The weather's course descending. Yeah, boy. Hi, Snakeys. It's me, Fifi, and I'm back. I'm back here today with another epic reaction for you guys. And today, I'll finally, finally be starting the Horn album first listen. Uh, sorry, it's taken me a little bit longer than expected to start it. However, we are here now and I'm super, super excited. A lot of you have been ranting and raving at how incredible this album is. And I know firsthand um, how great A Pink's B-Sides are. So I'm going to be doing this album first listen in parts. Today, part one um, will consist of the three tracks, Holy Moly, My Oh My and Nothing. Now, I'm aware there's performance videos for My Oh My and Nothing. I won't be doing a performance, the performance video for My Oh My because there was no like uh, performance um, uploaded on their official channel um, and that would definitely get blocked. Um, but I will be doing the performance video for nothing. Um, so the first two tracks will be like lyric videos and the last one will be the performance video. And yeah, I'm super, super excited. Let's just go. Okay, guys, quick disclaimer before we start, I will be doing lyric videos. However, I'm still gonna be 100% concentrating on the music, the music production, their vocals, so please don't expect uh, me to comment on the lyrics, some sort of lyrical analysis. That's not going to happen here. Okay, let's go. We're starting off with A-Pink. Holy moly! Let's go! <laughs> Now, before people start calling me hypocrite, yes, I am bored a 
of certain throwback 70s and 80s sounds however it's specific sounds that i'm bored of i think you guys know what i mean um however this is a throwback sound but it's something that hasn't been overdone and overplayed in k-pop it had that sort of 90s house element to it which i really really love it gives it this sort of expensive feel that sort of catwalk fashion walk luxurious um i literally just made a playlist recently uh, filled with well not filled it's like 11 tracks um with songs um that sound like this that have that sort of vibes it had uh luna choose um uh girls talk in there it had uh, Sonia, GWSN, uh, Girls in the Parks, uh, Tweaks, Tweaks. Um, it also had Timmy's uh, Trip, and this song would have fit perfectly in that playlist. Absolutely stunning. Those synths, those pads straight away, those melodies. I love the beat. Um, you really had that sort of 90s, sort of, just that beat. Absolutely fantastic. I love that. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, guys, let's go. Moving straight on to A Pink's My Oh My. Let's go. Touching song. I'm not going to go too too deep on the lyrics, but I was reading them and they were very very beautiful lyrics and they matched the instrumental very very well. I definitely vibed with the verses a little bit more uh, than the chorus, but I did enjoy the song overall. Such beautiful melodies, such beautiful chords. My favourite part was hands down the bridge. Stunning, stunning chord sequences. I think it was the post chorus of the first chorus. 
think I heard like some cello or violin, some sort of string instrument, and it sounded beautiful. I'm kind of sad we didn't get that sort of post chorus moment again after the second chorus because I really wanted to hear that sound come in again. It was so subtle, but it was so beautiful. It would have been really, really nice if we'd heard it more. Um, maybe during the bridge, like you had that, like we had like a little instrumental moment or just throughout the whole bridge. That would have been stunning because it sounded so nice. But yeah, overall, the song is very, very touching, uh, very, very heartwarming, um, gave me goosebumps. Uh, beautiful. Also, their, their vocals in this were stunning, stunning. Let's go on to the next one. Okay guys, let's go. We're now going to be doing the A-Pink Nothing performance video. I'm really, really excited for this. Let's go! <gasps> really nice thing to do. Oh, these voice chops, the voice manipulation. Oh my goodness! Fantastic. To be honest, that was snakery. That was R&B goodness. You guys know my favorite genre of music is 100% R&B. Give me R&B, bro. And I've known as a fact 
the A pink are really, really good with R&B. It reminded me of something that would have been on uh, Pink Revolution, maybe that sort of throwback, not too throwback R&B sound, but it is still very nostalgic. Bro, the seasoning, the flavor, oh my goodness, that was spicy. The choreo, the moves, oh my god. That was absolutely fantastic. The melodies, that that was towards the end. I love the piano and that, I love the beat, I love the scratching that came in towards the end as well. Again, like I said, I love the choreo, so many little quirky moments, their attitude, their sass. Oh my god, that was fantastic, 10 out of 10, that was my favourite one from today, hands down. That's got to, that has to be in my top three once I finally finish the album. It has to be. I already know there's going to be more bangers, but still, but still, that was absolutely fantastic. I'm really, really glad I did the performance video because, yeah, that was a performance. Fucking legends. Um, that's it, guys, I've got nothing else to say. I'm going to try and do part two, not next week, but the week after latest the week after that but i'm gonna aim for not next week the week after um and yeah that's it guys i've got nothing else to say if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you didn't like it subscribe if you haven't subscribed if you have subscribed i love you i love you gonna find me on instagram guys gonna find me on twitter and yeah goodbye oh